it will take uh, quite a lot of work to, to have it in, in good shape. It's, uh, it's very long and, and, uh, and, and unstructured. I think may all, all parties underline that. Yeah. I mean, 20 pages, that can, is that, can that be done in by tomorrow? <laughs> well, hopefully, but it will be in the hands of the presidency coming forward with a shorter uh, restructured, refocused text on the basis of comments. Thank you very much. Okay. Those are just uh, some uh, reflections of some of, some of the issues, but uh, no concrete uh, decisions have come through yet in the cover decision text. But do you think it's encouraging that it's grown to 20 pages now? No, um, I think it's a, uh, it's a drawback. We stand now really at a kind of a pivotal moment, to be very honest. Um, um, it's only two days formally, or one and a half day, uh, and, and basically we still do not know what the final conclusions of this, uh, this climate summit are going to be. Um, I think there are two main issues that are still there on the table. The first is, is of course very clear, we're not doing enough as a world to reach, to stay below this 1.5 degrees warming. We're not doing enough. More needs to be done, and still we haven't really seen much progress on that higher ambition level. Uh, the density document that has been provided earlier. You do not need 20 pages for that. That can be shorter, more concise, and clearer. I think the proposal, the non-paper, was too broad, too many topics, too vague language, and too many items which I don't think have to be in a cover decision. So it really needs to be slimmed down, and here, the Egyptian presidency really need to take that initiative because that's for the presidency to take that step. And as I said, time is limited, so we need to move fast. Water is life. Yeah.